hey guys welcome back to my channel today's video i'm just gonna take you guys around with me i'm gonna go shopping um yeah as you can probably already guess if you watched my last video i got my loan like the other part of my loan and um i put some of it in my savings and then i use the other part of it to pretty much pay off my credit cards and that from the last term because i used up pretty much my entire credit line and i couldn't pay it off so um yeah so we did that i uh, gotta finish putting on like some earrings and that but i'm gonna get headed out um i think i'm gonna go to westfield the mall in stratford for like the first time ever so i'm really excited um, I'm just gonna set you guys right here so I can put on my earrings. Please don't pay attention to my messy bed. It's like a disaster. But I just got these earrings yesterday from H&M as you can see. I think they're really cute. So I'm gonna put them on. Plus I think they go with my outfit because... Well I'll just show you my outfit in a second. But <clears throat> yeah I have this necklace on. It's from Brandy. So is my top. <laughs> And that's actually where I'm going to go right now before I go to the mall. Okay, don't judge me. I don't stand for what they believe in, but they have some really cute basic pieces. A lot of their clothes are like kind of ugly in my opinion because they're like flowery patterns. and Like I'm just not into that like little kid stuff. But they do have some really great basic pieces if you like spend time looking for them. And not always but some of their clothes are like really really soft and i have this one top that i absolutely love to death i got it from paxson but it was in like the brandy section and it's so soft i love it okay so these are my earrings i think they're so cute but um please don't pay attention to my messiness as you can see here i've been putting together outfits for the week <laughs> so I can finally wear clothes that I just haven't worn yet. Um, but yeah, as I said, earrings, H&M, necklace, brandy, top brandy, <laughs> bra, Savage X Fenty. It's that like unlined flower, not flower, I can't remember, but I'll like put it on screen for you guys here. So I didn't know I was like lifting the thing that high. And then my pants are from PacSun. I got them before I left. They're like kind of cropped. I don't know if they're supposed to. Sorry, you can't really tell. I don't know if they're supposed to come like <laughs> and hit me like right here. Um, I don't know if that's just me being tall or I don't know what it is because I'm not actually tall. I'm five foot four, guys, in case you're wondering, and really just average height, not tall at all. <laughs> So, yeah, um, I'm just gonna put on some shoes, get ready to go, I need to remember to put my ring on because I start feeling naked when I don't have it on. Um, I gotta get my purse together, one second. Okay, I'm pretty much ready to go, uh, I just have my headphones in, <laughs> my Bluetooth ones, and... Wait a minute, let me make sure I have all of my IDs and stuff. Yeah, okay. Let me put my bag on. By the way, if you're wondering... Sorry. Okay, if you're wondering what shoes I decided to pair with this outfit, I just went with these white crew socks from uh, Primark. They're like super cheap and they're really nice. They're comfortable. And I'm wearing my Nike... I don't know, but this is in French. In the bottom. They're the something I forgot the name of it. It's like a girl's name or something, but I'll put it on screen if you're wondering. Oh. Okay, so I'm just like really excited because I have gone shopping and what feels like forever. It's like yesterday I was with my friends. I was hanging out with Hamira and Sully, which a video coming soon with them. I'm really excited. We have to like plan the details in that out, but yeah. Um, let me stop here real quick. So yeah, um, 
I, we stopped at H&M just so I can like look at these earrings because I saw someone had them and I complimented them. I was like, oh, where'd you get them? They're like H&M. So I was like, okay, I'm going to stop in there. I ended up getting some leather pants. I've been really into the leather pants thing and I've been wanting to like try it out for myself. So I got those. A uh, hoodie, a Billie Eilish t-shirt. I love that t-shirt. Like I'm going to wear it all the time. And it's like a really nice neutral. It's a beige color as you can see. I wear a lot of white, beige, black, and gray. <laughs> I don't know. And then, what else did I get? These earrings, obviously. And I think I can't really remember all that well. But yeah, I'll catch you guys later because I don't want to get caught up recording. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry, but we need to talk about the weather because it's so nice here. I was just browsing, so we'll see how this goes. But if you're wondering, I went to Brandy and I picked up a few things. I literally just this is stuff. Um, all I did was pick up a hoodie, a cardigan, and some joggers, and then some earrings because I like their jewelry and it's cheap. So yeah. Okay, I didn't really show you because I wasn't sure, but this is literally the only thing I like. Are these joggers? We're back in my room, so let's do a little haul time, shall we? So we have these two bags. Why are they cool, you might ask? Because I went to a few stores and um, I started shoving things in the other bags. So, as you're all aware, I went to Pandora and all I got was this cute little charm for my bracelet 
tea that my boyfriend got me for Christmas. Not this past Christmas, but the Christmas prior. It's just this cute little dog. It's like a little Labrador Golden Retriever dog. Um, I had a charm that had like a paw print and it broke. It wasn't from Pandora, it was from somewhere else, but it broke nonetheless. And I was really saddened about it, so I decided to get another pet charm. And I also got a clasp opener because I'm tired of chipping this nail every single time I try to open this bracelet. So, yeah. Um, all together, it was like $45. Uh, yeah, $45. £45, my bad. Which is still pretty cheap, considering, like, charms back home run for like at least thirty dollars to at most like 90 something freaking dollars like i think pandora is a lot cheaper here than it is back at home oh my god i dropped it okay well as i was saying i think pandora here is a lot cheaper than it is back at home so i'm gonna have to cop a few more charms before i leave um, but I'm just going to save it till the end of my trip and see if I have money for it. Next, we're going to get into my brandy things. Yay! So, I got a guide to the mall because I had I looked at the map online, like, last night, so I knew where I'd be going and I knew what stores were there. And was I still lost? Yes. Yes, I was. Um, so I got this really oversized hoodie and it just says London. It has the flag and then it has Chelsea on it and it's embroidered which is nice so I know that it won't fade it's huge but I really am into the oversized type of situation um, I have another sweater it's not a hoodie but it's a like a large uh, literally the one that I was wearing in my last video that brown one with the little zipper that's from Brandy it has pockets on the side too and it's like super huge and oversized but I love that sweater it's so nice um, so I have another one to add to my collection. And then I got some joggers because I have joggers from Brandy but they're a dark gray. So I just got these light gray ones. And the other ones are like too long for me but these fit me like perfectly. I think they are made for petite people. Let me see if these are like in a specific- no these are one size. Why did I ask? Everything is one size. Surprisingly though, if you didn't know this, um, for their jeans, I think they have sizes small, medium, and maybe large. I've never seen a large, I've just seen the small and the medium. To be fair though, I've never like, digged through them, because when I get to medium is when I'm like, ah, this one would probably fit me. Does it? No. None of them fit me. But whatever. Um, and then this one is just... A gray, I mean not a gray, I'm clearly stupid. A brown little cardigan. Um, I'm trying to put more brown into my wardrobe just because I have like a lot of beige, black, gray, white. Actually, I don't even have that much white. She says that she's wearing a white t-shirt. Um, yeah, you'll be surprised. I have a lot more black and gray than anything else and I have a lot of black let's just say that oh yeah and then I got these cute little uh and then I got this cute little earring set it just has a small earring and then a big one I thought this would be cool and cute because I have my doubles um I'm not sure if this one is still open or not but I got the kit from Amazon that I used when I first pierced my ears um to open this one again because this one did close so yeah this is if you're wondering this is on amazon for like ten dollars and it works just as well as going to get your ears pierced save your money kids and those are earrings inside of it so you're literally just piercing your earring into your ear um do i know if that's safe no i'm not a professional ear piercer but I'm saving money, so that's all I really care about. And I didn't really get an ear infection, so it's also great. Um, and then I got these, I don't know what that is. These beige joggers. They fit, like, pretty tightly, especially on my butt. 
but a lot of things fit me tightly on my butt so unless i get them like super big these are just a size small um if you're wondering usually i get a size small for my tops and then like a medium for my bottoms unless i want it to fit me tighter than i do smalls um i do medium more when it comes to like jeans and that i'm in the medium category because my waist size is 27 slash 28 so yeah um and then sometimes i do get my tops in a medium as well just because i don't know <laughs> Also, I really do like getting my hoodies in a size medium because I like them to fit just a little bit roomier. It's like not that much bigger, but it's nice. Okay, cool. I'm gonna get into my little urban bag. No, I didn't do damage. By the way, if you're wondering, when I went to Urban and Topshop, was there any else? I also went to Doc Martens to get some socks. I used my student ID to get a student discount. So if you're ever going to go shopping, please, I urge you to bring your student ID with you so that you can get better deals. Um, I definitely do that because I just want to save as much money as possible. <laughs> so I've been eyeing these cute little corduroy bags. And I just picked up the one in like white or off-white, like a cream color. I think this is really cute. It's a neutral color, so it's going to go with a lot of things. And I just didn't want to get black, to be honest. That was the only color, other color that I liked. Um, so yeah, I might use this for school. Or when I start traveling, I can use it to like go around and chop around in that. Um, I wish I had a zipper to close, but it has a little button here to like clasp it close. So if you don't overfill it. You can close it. Uh, yeah. I'm just going to kind of throw things around wherever I can fit them. Uh, I got this pair of socks. These pair of socks. And then the lady at the register told me that it was two for eight pounds. Because these socks are originally six pounds each. I know what you're thinking. Like, why pay that much for socks? But I don't know. I just love this blue color and I thought they were really cute. I am a sucker for socks. I'm always going to wear them so I never feel too bad for spending money on that or underwear. But I usually like to try and get them on sale. Especially my underwear. Um, but yeah, so I just got these two. Uh, and you can tell this one's blue with orange. School colors. Hey. Not from here, but from back home. And then uh, this is just black with like neon cream on it. So. And then for a snack, I just picked up these blue bottle gummies. They're vegan. I'm trying to eat. I'm not trying. I am eating healthier. So I thought getting vegan snacks would be good. Um, yeah, I put on some weight throughout like the last, pretty much in scholars, I've like been fluctuating in weight. And so <laughs> I've gained it pretty much in my stomach, my ass, and my thighs. But I'm really trying to get it to go down in my stomach. Because obviously, nobody wants that in their stomach. Unless you do, that's fine. But like most people always talk about wanting flat stomachs. I don't particularly want it like flat, flat. Well, I want it flat. I Like I don't want to go down in waist size or anything. Because I'm not trying to rebuy jeans and all of that. Um, I just want it to be flatter. So I've been pretty much just eating all the foods that are recommended to lose belly fat. And it's been working really well. So if you're interested, I urge you to check out videos on YouTube of specific foods that help you lose belly fat. Um, it's really helpful if you're interested. Anyways. I am a smoothie. Oh yeah, I got one thing from Zara and it was just these black jeans. They're just high-waisted. Um... They fit me nicely. I was going to get the new Joni jeans. They have like belt loops in them now. Um, not all of them, but they're making them with belt loops now. And I was going to get the Joni jeans, but I'm very particular about my jeans, especially the material. It has to be, um, I mean, not itchy <laughs> because I do have dry skin. I also have eczema and I'm really prone to getting rashes on my legs. So I usually like to try to get jeans that have good soft 
material that aren't going to irritate my legs and so I wasn't too sold on the Joni jeans just because the material was like a little rough. I've had like two pairs of Joni jeans in the past. They're just like really stiff and like like not too rough but just like on the cusp of it. I don't know. So I just wanted to make sure that I was going to be spending my money on something that I was going to like and wear often. So plus these were cheaper. So yeah, these were 25 pounds. Um, I don't think I've been mentioning the prices for anything, and I don't know if I want to, because I don't really want to tell you guys how much I spent on things, but if you would like me to, I can put the prices down here. Maybe we'll see if editing me is feeling generous or feeling like giving myself away. <laughs> Uh, from Topshop, I got this cute little shirt. It's just really soft, and it was on sale for like six pounds. And then with my student discount, I got it probably for like four pounds. Uh, it's just kind of cropped. Um, I'm pretty sure this is supposed to be like tight and fitted because I got it in size UK 18. So yeah, I don't know. Or maybe this was in the petite section, although it doesn't say petite on it. I'm just I don't know, but it's really cute. I really. I'm into tie-dye print. I just never find a tie-dye print that I like from stores. So this one's really cute and I'm really excited because it's like super soft. Okay, please don't judge me, but I found these and they fit me and they were just really cute and I tried them on and they were in the sale section so I tried them on and then I asked if they were on sale and then the lady came back to me and she was like no they're not and I was like oh, why you do this to me I'm so upset but I still got them because I've really been wanting to get a cute pair of like mules these aren't really mules they have straps at the up here in the ankle but they're just really cute and they were a pretty good price so decided to get them why did I do this to myself? Because I'm going to have to find a way to pack this in my suitcase when I leave. I don't know. I really debated it. I was like, should I? Because of my suitcase. But then I was like, what if you travel and it's warm somewhere and you want to look cute and you have dresses? What are you going to wear them with? And I was like, damn. So you know what I did? I bought them. <laughs> yeah, I hate me too. But... <laughs> Okay, I'm so happy about this because I have been wanting a jean jacket with Sherpa lining for the longest, but I never find a one that fits me that's affordable. Yeah, pretty much that's it. If it fits me, it's usually not affordable, and if it doesn't fit me, it's usually affordable, so I can never win, but I saw these when I got here in like September. And they were 100 pounds, guys, and I was not going to spend that much on it. Also, I didn't really have that much money, so <laughs> couldn't even if I wanted to. But they were on sale because Topshop is having a sale right now. And it was 39 pounds, plus my student discounts. So I'm just really excited. I did go down in a size. This is a U.S. size 2, but I think it fits me a lot better. Plus, I like to wear stuff like this open more for fashion even though it does have the shirt lining but I can wear it here in London because the weather here is like fall all of the time which I love because lord knows I need a break from cold weather I am like super happy about that purchase also I don't have this item but I got a pair of Jamie flare jeans the material of the jeans were super soft and stretchy made my butt look great those jeans is really look nice and I wanted to kind of get something a little bit more out of my comfort zone and the thing that really pushed me was when I found those shoes and I was like oh my god it would be such a cute outfit like I could wear this top and those flare jeans and those shoes and like a belt and ugh, it would look so cute for like the summer or like the, the springtime I was just like that's such a fit I need to get these jeans <laughs> yeah I don't know why I did this to myself but yeah, that's 
what happens so I ended up getting those I have them here to show you but maybe if I get them I think I'm supposed to get them before this video will go up so when I edit this video maybe I'll insert a clip of me showing you the jeans that was all I got from Topshop and the last items that I have to show you are more songs <laughs> And if you're wondering why I got Doc Martin socks, um, it's just because I have a pair of these already. Like, these, except this is black, and then the bottom maroon part is yellow. And these are really, really great to wear with your Doc Martens. I mean, obviously, that's what they're meant for. But um, I love them because this really holds on my calves, so it doesn't move when I'm wearing my shoes. And other crew socks that I have move when I have my shoes in if they're not like tight enough. I don't know. Like the ones from Primark. I can't really wear them with my boots because they always slide down. I have some other socks that are okay if I wear it. Like it slides a little bit when it gets to my ankles it kind of stops. But I really want something that is going to stay. So I just picked up three more pairs. I got the double sock. It's just gray. And I think at the bottom, yeah at the bottom it has Dr. Martin's. And then I got this, which is like the ones that I already have, just in a different color. And I picked up this one. I think this one will grip just as good, but I think the other one grips better. Um, but yeah, this is another dog sock. So that is all that I got today, and all that I will be getting for a while. I'm trying not to go shopping anymore because I'm going to start looking into traveling and I want to have enough money for that. So yeah, I just really got excited and there's some things that I've been seeing, what I've been wanting, and so I just had to kind of go out and treat myself a little bit today, but yeah, probably won't be doing it again anytime soon, but it was really fun. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope you subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I post videos for the most part, <laughs> every Wednesday slash Thursday, I think that's the date that I'm kind of going to set myself on for now on. Because um, in the past, I did upload like every Sunday or something. Uh, yeah, I'm going to let you guys go. This video is already long enough, but I really hope you enjoyed it. And I hope that you give this video a thumbs up if you did. And if you didn't, then you ain't really got to do much. You could just press exit. Um... Or you could be mean and give me a thumbs down, I guess. But yeah. <laughs> I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.